the biggest increase in the size of our defence forces in peacetime in Australian history. This is a significant vote of confidence in our defence forces, but it's a significant recognition by our government, which has always been clear-eyed about the threats and the environment uh, that we face as a country, as a liberal democracy in the Indo-Pacific. Today I'm announcing that we will boost our defence forces by some 18 and a half thousand, which will take our defence forces to 80,000 in number. Now, this will cost some $38 billion out to 2040. When you look at what's happening in Europe at the moment, people who believe that President Putin's only ambition is for the Ukraine don't understand the history that our military leaders understand. If people think that the ambitions within the Indo-Pacific are restricted just to Taiwan and that there won't be knock-on impacts if we don't provide a deterrence effect and work closely with our colleagues and with our allies, then they don't understand the lessons of history.